Hey, how you doing today? I am Tequila Coleman. In today's video, I'm going to talk to you today about praying for the counterfeit's heart because I just released a dream, um, you know, right before this video, but I just released a dream where in the dream, the counterfeit, you know, they were trying to make um, their relationship with the God or their spouse appear to look one way when it really wasn't, right? And, you know, the guy, um, the counterfeit was trying to stop the God ordained spouse from coming back to his God ordained wife, right? So we are in a season where counterfeits, they know their time is up. They already know um, uh, the God ordained prodigal spouse is waking up. He is coming back into his right mind, right? They already know he has chosen their God ordained um, wife, okay, their spouse. And so they're going to be upset. So I'm going to be heartbroken, you know, um, that this counterfeit relationship didn't go as planned, right? They're going to be upset that their little witchcraft, you know, they spells, all that foolishness that they were trying to, you know, put on the God or their spouse didn't work, okay? Because whatever they done to you is coming back to them. They try to stop your finances, their finances about to be stopped and blocked, okay? They try to put sickness on you, they will be sick. Okay, whatever they try to do to you is coming back to them. They try to sabotage your opportunity. Oh, it's going to come back on them. Okay, but God is calling for his children to begin to move into prayer. Okay, praying on behalf of these counterfeits um, because, you know, God, he, he's always giving me dreams. Okay, he gave me a dream the other day, the other night, um, and I believe it was speaking to what I'm talking about now. But understand when God give us dreams, he is showing us what is taking place in the spirit, in the spirit realm. Okay. And so he want us to move into prayer so that we can stop and block what the enemy is trying to, you know, boil up in the spirit realm. Okay. Um, so he want us to pray against our bitterness in the heart, anger, resentment. Okay. He want us to pray against animosity you know uh retaliation you know all obsess obsession right because some of these kind of fear they are just obsessed with your god or their spouse they are obsessed with you that's why they keep stalking you and, and monitoring you everywhere you go they are obsessed with just winning right they don't really want your god or their spouse they just don't want to lose right so they are obsessed with this thing they are um you know some of these counterfeits are they're going to be very disappointed some you want to pray against all stalking harassment okay um pray against the spirit of murder okay uh the spirit of hate you know pray against the spirit of witchcraft you know um they're going to be trying to put spells on you you know separation spell love spells they're going to do these little um i don't know what it's called but it's like uh i want to say a death spell uh or a grave spell it's something like that pray against all of this stuff okay um trying to get payback okay you want to pray against all of these things and you want to begin to bind these things up in the name of jesus christ and you also want to begin to pray for their heart pray that god give them a peace that surpasses all their understanding during this time pray that god will heal their heart pray that god will uh create in them a clean heart and renew a right spirit within them pray for their salvation that they would turn from their wicked ways and begin to seek god's face and humble themselves then he will heal he will hear from heaven and heal their land okay begin to pray the fruit of the spirit come upon them like never before and they begin to walk in that fruit of the spirit begin to pray against all spirit of pride that is in operation through these counterfeits um you know just pray we it's a time where god is calling for us to move into prayer okay um and just pray for their heart okay uh, because they're going to be hurting. And I know some of you probably like, I don't care. <laughs> you don't know what this kind of fit done to me in my, you know, in the past. I get all of that. I really do. But this isn't tit for tat. It's really not. You know, you got to really see this in the spirit. Okay. Um, when God bring this love story together, you don't want anything attacking it. You don't want to be constantly looking 
over your over your shoulder okay no you want to go ahead and take that enemy out now in the spirit okay while god is bringing this to your attention go ahead move into taking authority over the situation give the enemy no room to try to uh come up against what god is joining together so you want to start now praying you know god had me all last week he just kept bringing it back to my mind pray pray for the counterfeit pray 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 it was like every single day you know while i'm cooking he like pray while i'm driving pray i'm like wow okay right but i understand they are going to go through some heartbreak some disappointment they really thought some of them really thought they were going to be the one who your god or their spouse marry and now things are not going as planned that can hurt it really can some of them really thought that they can come up against god but god is showing them who god is okay so moving to prayer you know just pray that god will have mercy on their soul understand and know that you already had the victory okay but uh god want us to go ahead and stop what the enemy is trying to you know get started up in that spirit realm okay so we are to pray for these kind of his heart so that is it i am tequila coleman i'll talk to you all real soon take care